Hello and welcome to everybody to our OV Transavius monitor for Audio Toolbox. In this video we will learn how to control an audio toolbox by using an AVX7. For more information about this toolbox, please visit our website and its documentation. So, with our AVBX7 in the control page, we have access to many functionalities. The first one, which is important if you have many devices, is the Identify button. By clicking it, it will make the LEDs of your panel blink 10 times so that you can recognize it. Then, we will go into the Rack Setup page. The first one is the Clock tab, where we can select the frequency up to 96 kHz and the Clock Master. Then we have the setup tab where we have the panel dimmer which sets the luminosity of the AVBX panel LEDs. Then we have the temperature inside the audio toolbox and control the fan manually. And then you have GPIOs in which you can plug in on off switches or knobs which will enable you to control physically any parameter that you want in AVS monitor. You can select them as outs or ins or a bit of both. And this is the box to tick to be able to use knobs to control input or output gains, for example. Then we have the status tab, where we can find information about names and firmwares. And then we have an important tab, which is the audio matrix, where you'll be able to automatically or manually route your audio signal in between the cards, as shown here. Let's now shrink the page so that it's more clear. And now we can see that, for example, the Dante inputs are routed to the Ethersound and to the MADI outputs. And also the Ethersound and MADI inputs are routed to the Dante outputs, up to 64 channels. You can also go to manual mode by clicking up here and confirming. And then you are able to route your audio signal very simply, just like this. By pressing shift before clicking for multiple routes, or simply by clicking. And finally, we have the Frequency Generator tab, where you can output a sinus wave or a chirp to control your system's quality or routing. And we have an integrity test to control very efficiently your network. You can also click directly on the icons to access, for example, to the clock page, or if you want to the setup page, or here for the Frequency Generator, and here for the matrix. Okay, so now let's go and see the slot setup page, where you can control the parameters of the cards in each slot. For example, in slot 1 we can control the HA remote and number of ins and outs of the Dante card. Slot 2 we can control the switch card with its RSTP VLAN linked or split modes. Then we can control the ASO mode for the Ethersound card to record up to 64 channels, etc. with every parameter of every card on each slot. Ok, so now you know the main functionalities to control an audio toolbox. Thank you for watching and see you soon.